This is the parish graveyard in Billy outside Bush Mills and this is best known for the, as being the final resting place of Robert Quigg VC. He's buried this down here. This modern headstone then, it is in memory of Sergeant Robert Quigg, 12th Battalion Royal Irish Rifles, who won the Victoria Cross, the VC, for most conspicuous bravery at the Battle of the Somme on the 1st of July 1916. He was born um, in this townland of Billy on the 12th of March 1885 and died 14th of May 1955. This modern, relatively modern headstone was erected by his comrades. Uh, you can see there's a number of, of tributes on the headstone as well. And Robert Quigg um, went out into no man's land um, following the, the, bat, the first battle of the Somme, the 1st of July 1916, on seven occasions to try to rescue his platoon officer, um, a man who he would have known uh, from, from the, the town of Bush Mills and that was uh, Sir McNaughton. Uh, sadly, his, despite going out seven times into no man's land, each time he brought back an injured comrade, but never, he never retrieved the body um, of uh, McNaughton. So he was awarded for his conspicuous bravery, as it says in his headstone, the Victoria Cross. And he's also commemorated in a statue in the town of Bush Mills as well. So again, the final resting place in the scenic and windy um, Billy graveyard outside Bush Mills in County Antrim. This is down in the centre of Bush Mills and this commemorates the heroic action of Robert Quigg, VC. He's commemorated on a little panel beside here, uh, born in 1885, died in 1955, and he was awarded the Victoria Cross for most conspicuous bravery at the Battle of the Somme. His citation reads, on 1st July 1916, he advanced to the assault with his platoon three times. Early next morning, hearing a rumor that his platoon officer, uh, McNaughton, uh, was lying out wounded, he went on out seven times, look for him under heavy shell and machine gun fire, each time bringing back a wounded man, the last man he dragged in a, on a waterproof sheet from within a few yards of the enemy's wire. He was seven hours engaged in this most gallant work and finally he was so exhausted that he had to give up. After service to the army, uh, Quigg returned uh, to live near Bush Mills and this sculpture was unveiled by Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II on the 28th of June, 2016. And on the panel here is, on the, on the ground, uh, it commemorates Rifleman Robert Quigg, serving with the Royal Irish Rifles for his services on 1st July, 1916, when he won the VC, Victoria Cross. Robert Quigg went into no man's land to try to rescue uh, McNaughton uh, from the town of Bush Mills and McNaughton uh, was killed his body was never recovered but he's commemorated here on a side panel of this very picturesque grave in Dunluce Parish Churchyard in Bush Mills he's commemorated on the side panel here as second lieutenant Sir Harry McNaughton Bart Baronet 12th Battalion Royal Irish Rifles born 12th February 1886 reported missing believed killed when leading his men in the attack of the Ulster Division near Hamel in France at the Battle of the Somme, 1st July 1916. His brother is also commemorated here, Sir Douglas McNaughton, Baronet, and he was killed in action when leading his men against the German trenches near Delville Wood 
in France at the Battle of the Somme, 15 September 1916. So again, Robert Quigg, he was going out, he went out into no man's land to try to rescue uh, Sir Harry McNaughton, who he would have known from his, his childhood in the town of Bushmill. So again, he's not buried here, and neither is Douglas, but they're both his brother Douglas, but they're both commemorated here uh, through this very scenic uh, angel on the grave here in the Loose Parish Church yard outside Bush Mills. <laughs>